to know which one has the greatest value. So first, all positive numbers are greater than negatives. Next we know um, the larger the exponent, once we have positives, larger the exponent, then the larger the value. So first we compare the positive and negative numbers, and then we compare the exponents. And then, if that doesn't help us, we compare the coefficients. Right? And those we can com just compare like the normal values and normal numbers. So here the only negative number is negative 8.4 times 10 to the second. That just equals negative 8.4 times 100, which is negative, right, 840. That's the smallest number here. That's out. We're looking for the greatest. So now all the exponents 2, 2, and negative 2. Well, negative 2 is the smallest exponent. It's not a negative number, it just means 8.4 divided by 10 twice, so it's 0 0.084, that's too small. Now these two have equal exponents, but one of them is the largest, so I compare the two coefficients. And 1.45 is greater than 1.045. So here, b is my answer as the greatest, the expression of having the greatest value. Alright, hope that helped.